What's the deal? What's the deal, YouTube? It's OG Scotty B Grinks here. And, uh, so let me see if I can remember this. Okay, this is about, um, this is a hard one. Um, okay, I was so dope for these guys. Uh, this one guy is named Smoke, we call him, right? And, uh, I fucked up and I owed him money. And, uh, so he was going around looking for people that owed him money and fucking punched a couple guys out or whatever, this and that. So I'm like, okay, well, fuck. And I didn't have the money and I'm like, okay, well, I better go get it. So for whatever reason, I found out about this guy that had counterfeit cash, right? And I'm like, fuck. okay, well, this is what I'll do. I'll go up and I'll take what I got and I'll go buy it enough counterfeit and then I can go to this box and I can flip some of that money in the dope and get it and then, you know, just get myself on top again and I'll be able to uh, make it right or at least show them that I got the product to make it right or right, whatever, right? So that was my plan. So I hopped on this bus. I had to go like way past Kingsway type of thing. I don't even remember how I met this guy. I had to go to this guy's house, and on the way on the bus, I met this fucking hippie. This fucking homeless hippie guy. And we're sitting there, and blah, 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 and we're talking, and he had a Grateful Dead patch or something, so I'm talking about the Grateful Dead. Because I forget that it was before I found out they were CIA fucking infiltrators, but whatever. Um, so I'm talking to him, and... He's just like, yeah, talk about acid. I'm like, fuck, I haven't done acid in a long time. And he's like, do you want to do something? I got some here. And he gave me a fucking hit of acid. So I took it. So mind you, I haven't done acid for a long time. And in downtown east side, fucking selling crack and heroin. I'm strung right the fuck out, worried about some guy that's after me looking for money. <laughs> so, <laughs> so I decided to drop acid. So I do. And I go up and I go up into this guy's house starting to get high, and just sitting there tripping or whatever, and I didn't wait for him to finish my hands. I already know these the little 20s, on this little gold thing on the bill, and whatever he was doing, it's a really good job. Okay, and I, I don't even remember what I gave him to get the money or whatever, I don't remember any of the dom denominations or anything like that, but anyways, I got a bunch of 20s, I'm like, okay, so I'm fucking high now, and I'm, get on the bus, and I'm, just tripping, I'm having a great time, and I'm like, fuck, and I, and I'm like, you know, like, I, now I gotta go try and sell dope, and on the street, right, and I'm fucking seeing tracers, just starting to peak, and I run into this guy, he looked like Beavis from Beavis and Butthead, I forgot his fucking name, but he was a cool dude, he was an heroin dealer, and I'm like, dude, I just dropped this acid, and he's like, what, and I'm like, yeah, man, I'm fucking peaking, and he's like, dude, put your dope away and just go enjoy yourself. I'm like, yeah, yeah, but I got to deal with this thing first. And he's like, fuck. <laughs> and so I'm walking around. I'm going to look to score. And I run into this guy, Newfie. And Newfie was like the collector for the guy I owed money to. And I'm like, fuck. And he's like, okay, Scotty, come on. Time's up. Fucking smoked all pissed off. Where's the money? Where's the money? I'm like, listen, listen. I just got to flip this shit. Blah, blah, blah. So just don't worry about it. I'll be just, I'll be around, man. Just for whatever. And he's like, no, 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 no. Fuck, here. Um, I either got to stay with you or you just fucking, you know, or he, I, he knew, he saw I had some money. I was doing the dope deal or whatever. So I'm just like, well, here. No, no. How, how did it go? However it went, he, he would see, like, kind of muscled me or like, no, no, like, fuck. I'm like, okay, well, and I was trying to tell him I needed to flip it, but I didn't tell him it was counterfeit. And he's like, no, fuck it, you got to pay him. And he grabs the money from me. So I'm like, okay, whatever. I still had some real cash on me in my sock. I just, I had that. So I didn't know this, but he owed smoke money himself. So that's why he was so adamant about me getting this money to smoke because he owed him as well so he so he was in shit so he ditches me he goes and he goes down to go pay smoke this money that was supposed to be my money and he goes and pays the guy 
<laughs> and saying it's his money, and the guy notices it's his counterfeit and fucking smashes him with a shovel. <laughs> and then so, so I'm fucking just running around, and I'm high, and I just start. I was I was sitting down, and I was flipping a bit of dope, and I'm like, uh, I'm sitting there, and some guy sits down, and he comes up to me, and he's like, okay, well, can you? Can you get me a couple packages and this and that? And I start tripping out on what he's talking about, like packages and this. And 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 he and he starts going, Scotty, fuck, can you get me this fucking dope? And I'm like, yeah, man, I just dropped some acid. And he's like, what the fuck? And he gets up and he runs away. He was like trying to do a deal where the deal was right there, and he needed the money and the dope and everything sort of thing. So, and I'm just too high to deal with it. So, I went off and I uh. I uh, I just went off and I tripped out the rest of that night, and then I wake up, bang, 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 bang on my door, and it's smoke, and he's like, "Fuck, Scotty, you owe me money. I want my fucking money." But now he's been up all night and he's smoking crack himself, so he's not even worried about the money for fucking his re-up or anything. Now, now he just wants to smoke rock, and so I'm like, "Fuck, okay." I can deal with this because I was good at that. I was, I I had fifty or sixty bucks on me at the time, and I, and I'm like, well, just stay with me. And I was good, so I was able to run around and flip dope, and I was able to appease him with fucking some tokes, and then pay him his cash and whatever, and I was able to settle the deal. But uh, yeah, that was funny. I run into that to that newfie in, in jail, he ended up being my cellmate, and we were talking about that, <laughs> and I just, and we just, we both had a laugh about it, because uh, he was like, well, fuck, I was trying to rip you off, <laughs> and then I'm like, well, fuck, I was trying to, I was going to tell you it was counterfeit, but when you ran off with it, I kind of thought you owed him money, so, <laughs> but anyways, yeah, that's just kind of a, a funny story, um, don't deal with counterfeit money kids.